Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Um, if you're new here, my name is Nayeli. So today I'm gonna try something new on my channel. This is actually my first English video. I was speaking to my mom the other day and she suggested I record a video in English. Actually, it was more of a question. She asked why I didn't record in English. All the videos on my channel are in Spanish because I am Mexican. My parents both do speak Spanish. Their families speak Spanish. My aunts, uncles, my extended family, my cousins. I would say that on my dad's side, I have more family that speak Spanish. And then on my mom's side, I have a mix of both. I initially wanted to connect to my roots. I wanted my family to understand what I was saying when they watched my videos. And that's why my videos started in Spanish. I feel a little bit weird actually recording in English. So with that being said, I will be throwing in this video a little bit of Spanish words. That's just how my brain works. Um, I do think mostly in English, but I do uh, forget words sometimes in English and in Spanish too. I honestly don't know if I'll upload this video. I feel like more of my personality comes out in English. When I record in Spanish, my videos are, tend to be a little bit more like on the professional side where I just feel like I can't let loose as easily because of the whole translating and then I'm hoping I don't say something wrong and stuff. If this video isn't too cringe, I'll for sure upload it. So if I did decide to upload this video and you want to see this what's in my bag, keep watching. And I did record a Spanish what's in my bag and the purse that I showed in that video is actually not the purse that I'm currently using. A subscriber requested a what's in my bag under a video where I was using that bag. So I feel like that's the bag that she wanted to see so that's the one I used for that video. The purse that I'm currently using is actually a backpack. It's this backpack from Coach. This is actually my very first coach backpack ever. I've had it in my collection for 12 years, 10. I believe I used her when I was a sophomore in high school or a senior. And then I used her when I worked retail at a store. She's been with me through thick and thin. I hadn't used her in a while and I recently cleaned out my room and I just saw her on the shelf and I just wanted something different this summer. Just the colors and everything I feel like were perfect. I don't know if she can be considered vintage. Um, she's more like Y2K, I would say. So she looks like this. She has a compartment here, another compartment on the other side, and she has a zipper compartment right here, and then a bigger compartment that closes with these little string things. Just an FYI, this is going to be a very realistic what's in my bag. I don't know what's in here, but let's get started. So I'm gonna start with the side pockets, go into this little tiny zipper pocket, and then go into the bigger one. So on the side pocket, I have blue light glasses. I bought these in a pack from Amazon and I love these. I'm actually unemployed at the moment. I'm not working but when I did work I would use these to block the blue light. It would help with headaches and my eyes not hurting and feeling super super sensitive but I do like the way that they look too especially when I don't have any makeup on. They just give me like a little oomph, you know? <laughs> this is what they look like. They make me look smart. You know, like I said, I bought these on Amazon. It was like a pack of like 10, eight, something like that. Love these. Okay, let's see what else I have in here. I have a lipstick, liquid lipstick. Uh, this is from Dose of Colors and the shade is Lazy Daisy. It's just like a little nude. I have a tissue, gross. I also have a NYX Fat Oil in the shade Newsfeed. I love this thing, actually. Okay, so that's what was in that pocket. And then on the other side, I have another tissue. This one isn't used good. I have my favorite lip oil at the moment. I've just found myself reaching out for this one the most recently. This is the Rare Beauty Lip Oil and it's in the shade Honesty. Then I also have this 
Maybelline ink crayon. This is kind of like on my lips, but better. That's what I like about this one. This is in the shade, I have no idea. It doesn't really say. This looks like this, it's like a nude. Like I said, it's my lips, but better. And that's it for that side pocket. Let's continue on with this zipper pocket. I'm just gonna place the backpack on my lap because it's pretty heavy. So I have receipts, not a surprise. I just keep these and I really should tell them that I don't need a receipt, but I just take them just in case, just in case they overcharge me, just in case I have to return something. I just, I like to keep them. I also have a ton of bobby pins in here. So this is what the pocket looks like. <laughs> They're just all in here. I'm not gonna take them out, I'll just show you. I don't know why I have those in there. I really don't use bobby pins, but I feel like I didn't clean those out when I started to use the purse, so that's that. Moving on to the big pocket, there's a lot in there. Oh, the backpack does have two little compartments on here, the front. It would be the front here where I do have things as well. And then uh, there's a zipper pocket on the back and then it has like the coach patch back here that shows that it's authentic. Again, I'm just gonna put her on my lap and then just dig in there, show you guys what comes out. So the first thing I have is my pepper spray. I used to just carry the pepper spray by itself. When I do have a smaller purse, I do carry it by itself because obviously this little plushie takes up so much room. But since it's in the backpack, and there's space i just like to keep it in there just in case i need to grab it quick i can just dig in there feel the plushie and pull it out i got this plushie in a store in mexico she's a little hello kitty in a bear costume and she's kind of like blinged out it's cute <laughs> The next thing I have in here is my wallet. This one is also from Coach. It is in the signature leather canvas. I think that's what it's called. And this is what it looks like. It has card slots back here. I just have my pink Victoria's Secret credit card there. And then it has another compartment in the front. I have my driver's license and then my credit card in the zipper i have a little bit of cash i usually don't ever carry cash with me i just feel like i lose it or i just don't need it or it is just i yeah i really don't like to carry cash with me then i have my bank card the atm card my that goes like directly to my checking it's actually a pretty big compartment i love 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 this wallet okay so moving on i do have a brush i didn't ever carry a brush with me um okay so a little little story really quick i trained my hair to middle part i actually i'm not i don't have a middle part right now i have a side part but i did train it i'm still training it it's not 100 percent there yet something i did notice with the middle part is that you just you need to keep a brush or else it looks messy i never ever ever noticed that with a side part i guess i just didn't really care but ever since i style using a middle part sometimes i was like okay i need to carry a brush so i got this on shein i think it's like one or two dollars it's pink it's small it fits in your purse i love it moving on i do have a hand sanitizer this is from touchland it says it's a rainwater scented so i do keep that in there i do tend to use either hand sanitizer in a form of a spray in a form of a gel or i like to use wipes as well and that being said i do have wipes in my bag as well but once i repurchase these and repurchase them and repurchase them i just i love wipes i just like feeling like the germs stay on the wipes and hand sanitizer like a spray or a, a gel doesn't really do that for me so i need these i do have my keys as well this is also from coach it actually matches my wallet that's why i chose this key case specifically opening it up i do have my house keys my room keys my the key to my car i have a bottle opener that i bought in vegas 
Um, I'm actually probably gonna take this out. Like I, I actually mentioned that in my advantage what's in my bag. I need to take that out because it's just, it takes up space. And then I do have a, a bunny leg. I wouldn't purchase this myself, but I was actually gifted this by a salesman in Mexico. We purchased some Western items at his store and he gifted us the little bunny leg he said they are good luck so that's why i have that in there the card case does have these slots where you can put your credit cards in or bank cards or whatever in here i don't keep cards in here i just have little saints images and angels back here that i like to thank protect me and guide me i usually don't like to put anything in here because the key case it has like trouble closing and i just feel like it's really stiff and i just i don't like that so yeah those are my keys next thing i do have a pair of sunglasses i like to say that these are my bad bunny glasses if you know who bad bunny is yeah if you know you know <laughs> so uh, these are that for me yeah 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 <laughs> i think i got these in tilly's they were like 10 12 dollars i like to keep those in there i do have another pair of blue light glasses in here the ones that i showed you guys previously i think those are actually the ones that i keep in my car and then i keep ones in here just in case i need them these are actually just clear and visible i like them a lot moving on i have an emergency little pouch i do have lotion in here i have a wet wipe just in case i don't have my wet ones i have one in here i have a little floss stick I, I can't remember what they're called but i have that in there i have a sample of the flower bomb perfume in here just in case i need to touch up and i forget my spray or my perfume that i'm using um and then i have toothpaste no toothbrush just toothpaste and then i have eyelash glue they're just so annoying when they poke you or when they're coming off i have that little glue in there for that and then i have have a sharpener a lip pencil sharpener just in case I need it and then I have this like little file for my nails when I do have just my natural nails sometimes they break um, they're very thin I just like to file them down so they don't get caught on my clothes or scratch me or anything like that I have that in there and that's uh, I got the little pouch from Shein and it was like one or two dollars so that's that I do have another pouch with makeup stuff I actually don't carry makeup around with me I just feel like it adds a lot of weight to my bag and I take a while to get ready to do my makeup and makeup is expensive so I expect my makeup to last a while that's why i don't carry anything i do however carry a blotter otzi which is basically acts the same as rice paper okay, let me rewind a little not get ahead of myself so this is my makeup pouch i purchased this hello kitty pouch in mini so i got it in mexico actually it's just a little pink pouch it opens up with a zipper and like i said i have a blotter otzi in here it acts the same as rice paper and it has a mirror on this side this is actually by beauty blender it's the same shape as a beauty blender the little sponges are actually the same material as a beauty blender as well i actually don't even know if they still sell these but i just i love it so i do have combination skin i tend to get very oily on my t-zone i just like to blot with this and get rid of the little excess oil that I have. It doesn't really move your makeup. It doesn't remove as much makeup. I actually haven't washed these. So they kind of look like they have a lot of makeup. But it really doesn't take any away. I just, I love it. So I have that in there. I also have a Hello Kitty mirror. It just looks like this. It has the Hello Kitty print on there. I actually got this at Marshalls. The Hello Kitty girlies, all the Hello Kitty runs on 
TikTok. I don't know if you were into that at all, but I just kept seeing it on TikTok. I'm not a huge Hello Kitty fan. I feel like I liked Barbies and Bratz more when I was younger, but with Hello Kitty and like the whole Hello Kitty trend, um, I just feel like it was the thrill of the hunt of actually like going and finding stuff. There was a lot of resellers too, so the stores were pretty empty. So when you did find something, it felt nice. It felt, it was, it was just the thrill. This is my little Hello, Hello Kitty mirror. It just has a normal side. Oh, I'm sorry if I blind you guys with my ring light. Um, it just has the normal side here. Then this right here is a 3X mirror. That doesn't have an LED light. So I like to use it this way so the light kind of shines on there and it reflects on me when I do need to use the 3X side. I love this little thing. And then I do have chapsticks in here. Sometimes I do need to moisturize and I don't have anything to moisturize with. So what I do keep in there is this Be Pure lip oil. I got this at the dollar store and I actually love it. It has rose oil so you apply it to your lips and it gives you like a little red tint depending on your pH on your pH level I think that's what it says yeah so I love this thing and then I just have a regular Blistex in there chapstick if I just want to moisturize and I don't want any color this is what I use that's my little makeup bag okay, so what else do I have in here I have saline nasal mist for my allergies I get really bad allergies sometimes this just clears my nostrils my little breathing airways so I keep that in there. And then I do have a hand lotion that I keep in there at the moment because it matches my body spray. It is the Brazilian Touch Hand Cream by Sol de Janeiro, Sol de Janeiro. <laughs> I keep that in there. With that said, I do carry the Brazilian Crush number 62. I absolutely love this thing. I just, I, I love it. It makes my hair smell good it just it blends in with my body odor so nicely I just I I love it I don't love it as much when I first spray it but once it sets in and you give it a little time it just it makes you smell so delicious I've repurchased it and repurchased it and repurchased it I just I love it we're almost done there's just a few things left a few things left in here I do have Kleenex I like I said I do have really bad allergies sometimes so I need to keep Kleenex at all times this is a definite repurchase for me too and then I have a gum in here I'm actually down to two of the Orbit gum and then when I want a little bit more flavor and not something so minty I do keep the Trident bubble gum it's just a little like little sweet thing after eating I keep that I do keep mints when I feel like I just need to freshen my breath when I'm like in a rush and I'm gonna meet somebody and I can't brush my teeth I carry these and then I have a pen I actually don't even know if this works anymore let me try it on my gum pack I got these on, I want to say it was AliExpress, Timu, Shein, I don't know, but it's a little panda. I've actually had him for a while and I actually don't really use him. I've, I don't think I've ever needed him. I just like to keep him around just, just in case I do need him any day. And then the last thing I do have in this big pouch and then we'll move on to these little ones is another clear little baggie with just hair stuff sometimes i need to put my hair up and i don't have anything to put it up with so i just keep elastics in here what are they what are they called hair bands ligas in spanish there are these and then i do have this like little satin one and then i do have this little my melody it has like a little brush on it and then it has a comb on it too just in case I need them, just in case I want to part my hair another way, just in case I forget my big brush, I can use this. I got this at Miniso as well, along with the uh, Hello Kitty pouch. Got it the same day, and I 
actually really like this i've used it a lot actually so i love that and then the little clear pouch itself is my melody it's like a little purple pouch it's so cute my sister gifted me this little pouch so i don't know i'm not sure where she got it from moving on to these little pouches in here i have a little jewelry case i what do i keep in here i have a heart rose quartz in here i hope to find the love of my life um so i keep it in here all the time with me i carry it around for self-love too so i keep that in here and then sometimes if i want to take off my rings or my earrings or something i like to put the jewelry in here so i don't lose it and then i do keep a pill case in here what do i have at the moment i only have allergy medicine in here sometimes i do keep painkillers in here just in case i have a headache or you know for like that time of the month or i keep my vitamins in here sometimes too i need to refill this actually that's it for that pouch moving on to the other one let's just take everything out surprise surprise i have another lippy this one is an elf lip oil this one is in the shade honey talks honey talks money talks Honey talks, honey talks. This is a little nude. And then I have lip makeup remover pads sometimes. I just want to switch my lip color or sometimes I just feel like my lips are super dry or sometimes I get that like little nasty white line in my lips, which just means I apply too much, too much product and then the air and then the talking and all of that. I just need to refresh my lips sometimes. So I keep those in there and these are from AOA. There is a zipper pocket in here and I usually keep pads in here, but I don't have any at the moment. Okay, so that brings us to the end of this video. If you stayed till the end of this video, thank you so much. Like I said, this is my first English video. I hope it's not too cringe. I hope I convinced myself to actually upload it. So we will see. We will see if you guys like it, what reach it has. Um, I felt very comfortable recording it. Like I said, more of my personality shows. I'm much more comfortable recording in English because I don't have to translate every Thing. don't have to overthink everything so if you guys do like it please let me know below if you speak spanish if your family speaks spanish please recommend my videos to them to your abuelita to your tia to your mom to to everybody <laughs> so i really don't know how to close this video um i guess i will see you guys soon